you know, at the risk of laboring this point a little bit more, I think that people often think about identity as a single product, whereas actually it spans across many different industries and, and many different solutions. So, you know, to give you an example here, if you're going to be doing a supply chain track and trace solution, where you're going to try to prove the provenance of a good like coffee from the farmer um, to where it's sold maybe as a, a six pound espresso in London, and you're trying to make sure that you can transfer more value back to that farmer when that final sale is done. Well, how's that going to happen? Well, one is that you could have a smart contract, um, which will enable automatic payment back to the farmer when the sale happens. But, you know, who's that farmer? Well, you need an identity for that farmer. You also want to have an identity for all the people along that supply chain, the exporters, um, the roasters. Uh, so when we talk about identity, for me, it's it's enabling us to get into many, many different industries. So this is supply chain track and trace. This can be health records. Um, you know, this can be, um, you know, opening up loans and insurance. So this is the reason why I bang on about it, because once you get identity and you find product market fit on it, you're really opening yourself up to many multi-billion dollar industries.